Yo, what's going on, Leafer Nation? It's Leafer back again, and welcome back to the channel. It's been a while since I uploaded, but guys, it is NHL 21 season. Yes, the game has finally dropped. If you uh, do not have EA Play yet, make sure to go subscribe for the month or for the year uh, so you get a 10-hour trial before the actual game drops. So go ahead and do that, but today's video will be how to do all deeks in NHL 21. <laughs> Now there are uh, the same deeks that I've covered uh, previously in NHL 20, which I will be going over again, but EA has added in some new deeks this year and some new moves this year into the game, which I'm going to be covering in this video as well. Now if you guys wanted to learn how to do certain deeks and you know some already, I've left timestamps down below in the description. Uh, I will label everything for you, so if you want to learn how to do the behind the back of the Zetterberg, it'll be timestamp for you. Just click on the timestamp and it'll take you to that deke. But regardless, it is time to get into this video and I'm going to teach you guys how to do some of these deeks that are... Uh, fairly simple and some that are very very hard to do um, but if you practice and go over what I tell you to do I'm sure you will learn how to do the deeks and um, yeah let's get into it okay so starting off first I thought you know what let's start off with something simple so I'm gonna do the backhand tuck and the forehand tuck first but first I'll show you how to do the backhand tuck um, this move was very um, OP in NHL 20 I think they did nerf it in NHL 21, but it can still be used um, good on human goalies and potentially AI goalies in some situations. So to do the backhand tuck, what you're going to want to do is hold your stick out to your forehand. While holding that out uh, with your forehand, you're going to hit both RB and LB, and that'll make the deke to do the backhand tuck. Now with the forehand tuck, it's the same thing. You're just holding your stick out to your backhand and then hitting both RB and LB to pull off the move. Next thing I'm gonna show you guys how to do are the windmill deke. So first things first is the backhand windmill. Again, a fairly simple deke to pull off. What you're gonna wanna do is hold um, LB and while holding the LB, you're gonna go out with your right stick and it'll pull off the backhand windmill. And the forehand windmill, uh, very similar to the backhand windmill, you're gonna be holding down LB, but instead of going out to uh, the right with your right stick you're gonna be going out to the left with your right stick and that'll pull off the forehand windmill now this move is new and they just added it in to the game it is called the bank pass I don't know if it's called the bank pass I'm gonna call it the bank pass um, but this is what it looks like you're just gonna be banking the puck off of the board so to pull off this deke what you're gonna want to do is uh, click LB and RT at the same time it'll chip the puck off the boards or into the middle of the ice and uh, it, it's it's a very cool move and you can get around opponents very easily this is something that they just added into the game which will be very useful to use now this is also new I'm gonna call this one the Crosby it's a bank pass but behind the net so it's the same thing you're gonna be clicking both LB and RT but this animation will bounce the puck off of behind the net you can get around a defender that's on your back go around him and loop up to the front so a, a very cool move that they added I'm calling this one the Crosby because Crosby's done it in game the next deke I'm gonna show you guys how to do is the behind the back this one is um, on the end of being more complicated to pull off so if you need to go over it a couple times just slow down the video go back do what you got to do but I'm gonna tell you guys how to do it it is fairly simple once you pull it off for the first time so to do the behind the back with a right-handed player all these will be shown in, uh, with a right-handed player but I do have the controls for a left-handed player on the bottom left of the screen so to do the behind the back with a right-handed player you're gonna hold your puck out to your forehand you're going to hit and then hold RB while doing that you're going to rotate your right stick to the left and put your left stick inwards and then both stick outwards and that'll pull off the behind the back so it's a very it's a more of a complicated deke to do it will take you some time to learn this one it took me some time to learn this one but it is fairly simple to pull off once you start getting the hang of it um, so yeah that's the behind the back deke the next uh, moves I'm gonna show you are the between the legs pass and the between the legs shot fairly simple deeks to pull off and very cool to pull off as well so for the between the legs pass what you're gonna want to do is hold down an LB and click down on your right stick and then hit RT to pass the puck fairly simple to do and then to do the between the leg shots again similar to the between the legs pass you're gonna hold down LB and then hold down your right stick and then flick up uh, your right stick like you're shooting the puck normally and that'll pull off the between the leg shot 
Next two dekes I'm going to show you again, very simple and very similar to each other. It's the Datsuk flip and the Datsuk shot. So first off, I'll show you how to do the Datsuk flip. So what you're going to want to do to do the Datsuk flip is click your right stick in and then uh, bring your right stick downwards and then hit RB to flick the puck up. Um, this is very useful to use on um, a human goalie most of the time just to trick him out, but very simple deke to do. And then the Datsuk shot, very similar to that, click your right stick in uh, push it downwards and then flick up on the right stick to shoot the puck like you would normally and uh, this will give you a very powerful shot but a very inaccurate shot most of the time another simple deke to do this one is called the jump deke very simple it's going to take you two seconds to learn literally click rb and then flick up your right stick and that's a jump deke very very simple so this one was in nhl 20 but it looks like it's more um tuned in nhl 21 so this one is called the kutrov this this one is another one that is very um, complicated to do and I don't know when you're really going to need to use this or when it's very useful to use this but it is cool if you do pull it off I guess. So what you're going to want to do to do the Kucherov is hold your puck to your forehand, um, you're going to hit and then hold LB, then you're going to go down with the left stick and then down with the right stick and this will pull off the Kucherov where you essentially um, kind of fake with the goalie like you're deking and you just lose a puck mid deke and try to go five hole or into an open area. Like I said, I don't know when this deke is going to be useful, but hey, if you want to learn it, there it is. Now this one, this is the new deke that everyone's been talking about, the Michigan or the Sveshnikov, whatever you want to call it, this deke man is the hardest deke to pull off i guarantee you these are the controls on how to do it you need to get your timing down right when doing it so doing the michigan what you're going to want to do is hold your puck to your forehand you're going to hold down lb then you're going to hold in your right stick while you're holding in your right stick you're then going to rotate your your right stick to the left and then to the right now to make up how you get this deke right from what i've heard from ben ross is the timing of when you go with your right stick rotating it from the left to right how fast or how slow you do it you need to get that timing right you need a player with very good deking uh, attributes and and all that good stuff so it's going to be very hard to pull off that's why i'm showing footage from the from the trailer but um yeah if you pull it off it looks super cool but like i said super hard to pull off so i'm going to take you guys back down to earth i'm going to show you guys a very simple deke two simple dekes to pull off actually this one is called the one touch backhand deke and the one touch forehand deke two very similar dekes that are very effective in game so to do the one touch backhand you're going to hit lb and at the same time uh, with the right stick very simple to do and then with the one touch forehand you're going to do the same thing hit lb but this time you're going out with the right stick another very simple deke this one's called a skate kick um i guess this one could be effective in games uh so what you're going to want to do very simple again hold down lb and at the same time down with the right stick and this will bring the stick back to your skate and you kick it back up to your skate next we got the through the legs deke to do the through the legs deke what you're going to want to do is hold the puck to your forehand uh, while you're holding it to your forehand, you're then going to hit RB and then rotate your right stick to the left and that'll put the puck between your legs. Very simple deke, you can't get much simpler than the toe drag. To pull off the toe drag, what you're going to want to do is hold your puck to your forehand and then rotate your right stick to the left and this will pull off the toe drag. This one, the Kyle Turris deke, another complicated deke to learn, not really useful in game but looks cool if you pull it off. Uh, what you're going to want to do to pull off the Kyle Turris deke is hold the puck to your forehand, you're going to hit and then hold LB and then while you're doing that you're going to go down with your right stick and this will push the puck um, to your skate outwards and then kick out back to your stick. And then another complicated deke to do, kind of complicated I guess, this one's called the Zetterberg. So to do the Zetterberg what you're going to want to do is hold the puck to your backhand, you're then going to hit and hold LB and you're going to go outward with both analog sticks and then inwards with both sticks. Very cool deke to pull off. Alright guys, so that is all of the dekes in NHL 21. Um, hopefully I didn't miss anything if I did leave it in the comment section below so guys that is going to be it for this video again um, if you want to learn how to do a specific deke the timestamps will be down in the description you can just click on that timestamp and it'll take you to that deke so guys hopefully I was able to help you learn how to do these NHL 21 deeks and these new deeks that they added in as well if I did help you guys I'll make sure to drop a like and if you guys are new around here make sure to hit the subscribe button as I will be coming out with more tutorials in NHL 21 and some big pack openings maybe a couple 
Hut series and be a pro series. So make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace!